welcome back to my channel. I am your host, Mr. Awesome himself, and today is Wednesday, new comic book day. I'm gonna take today and I'm gonna show off some comic books I got the last couple weeks. I got a, two packages, one from eBay, one from Midtown Comics, and I got a few from my local comic shops and a pack, a huge stack here that I got from the Coliseum of Comics Warehouse, which they open only on Saturdays from 9 to 2 p.m., I guess. And they have amazing deals on comic book, toys, Funko Pop, you name it, they have it. Uh, I'm gonna show off first the newer comic books. I got this Dawn of DC, Night Terrors, number three. Then I got Miles Morales, Spider-Man number nine. He's fighting there the Hobgoblin. Then I got, I think it's Avengers number four. This is an Alex Ross cover, which looks sick. Then we have Children of the Vault. This is from the Fall of X saga, which is amazing. If you have not read Hellfire Club, oh no. Hellfire Gala 2023. Blow your mind. Story. And I got Amazing Spider-Man 31. This is the Miss Marvel cover. Look at that. That looks sick. Then I'm gonna show you all the ones I got from the warehouse sale before I open these packages. Hope you're all staying safe. So here we have Astonishing X-Men number 14. You see Wolverine there kissing Emma Frost. This is from the Joss Whedon era. Then we have here, Peter and Mary Jane, Spider-Man Scrapbook, 1999. I do collect a lot of Spider-Man, so if I see anything that interests me in Spider-Man, I'll buy it. I have here, Ultimate Fantastic Four, number two. This is, I got this because I know this is the second appearance of Mr. Fantastic, which is the maker now, a big villain in the Ultimate Invasion saga, so. I got X Factor number eight. There's the Brotherhood of Mutants right there. Pretty cool. I got this Superman 82. I just got this for the cover. Look at the shiny goodness here. Hey, LJ. I got Rogue number one. I got the Amazing Spider-Man number one. This is the Nick Spencer run. I love this cover though. Here. Pretty, pretty cool. I got Astonishing X-Men number one. I got X-Men Chronicles number one. This is from the Age of Apocalypse Saga. This is a wraparound cover. I got X-Factor number two. I need to, I will bag and board them soon. I got this cool Generation X cover. This is Generation X 28. I love this, look at the Jubilee. She looks bad, beep. Then we have X Factor number 33. This is a tie-in to Secret Invasion. Then we have X Force number three. Love the Juggernaut cover right there. And I look the back, look at the old Toy Biz figures from the X-Men cartoon. Which I am currently rewatching before the new season comes out. I got here X Factor 58. Love this Archangel one. Then, if you know me, I'm a wrestling fan and I got this WWE comic book number one. You can see the shield there Seth Rollins, Dean Ambrose, now John Moxley, Roman Reigns, and Triple H. Then I got this super size animal X Factor. The apocalypse there. Then we have Excalibur 82 from the Fatus Covenant. I just love this color right there. That's forged right there. Then we have from the Inferno tie-in, Excalibur number seven. I think this is Rachel Summers marrying a little, little nightcrawler, a little demon there. Then we have Excalibur number one. This is the annual number one. This one comes with a cool trading card. It's right here. 
Look, Mortal Kombat. Wow. Then we have Ultimate X Men number 100. I just got this for the cover. I got Astonishing X Men number 10. Cool Savior cover there. Then I got X Men number 1. This is from the Age of Apocalypse saga. X Men number 2. And X Men number 3. Then we have here X Men The Search for Cyclops Book 3. Beep. Cable 34. This is an Onslaught tie in. It's there fighting the Hulk. X Men The Search for Cyclops Book 1. Uh, X Men The Search for Cyclops Book 2. I love this cover. Uh, Extreme X Men number 2. This is by Chris Claremont. And we have here Rogue and Gambit. And the last one I got was Dark X Men number one. I just love this cover. Look at that. We got Mystique, Angel, Beast, and Omega, I guess. Those were the ones I got from the Coliseum of Comics Warehouse. Now let's open up this eBay package. This took a while to get here, even though it was like. Two cities from here, from Tampa. I live in Orlando. Uh, apparently, he made a mistake when he left it off in the his apartment office. I don't know. I had to ask him, like, oh, "What's my package?" And he was, like, "Oh my God, it's still here." But great communication, so I have no complaints on that. This is a run that is very expensive to find on, or if you find it on trade paperbacks. So I just ordered, I just bought from the guy the whole, the whole set. So I can finally read it, which I never did. It's an old run from Venom. And it is Venomized. This is the Venomized set, this is Venomized number one. Venomized number two. Venomized number three. I like that cover. Venomize number four. And Venomize number five, Cinco. And that was the set I got from eBay. Hopefully I can sit down today and read it. The last thing for today, we have our famous Midtown Comic Package. I usually order from them every once in a while. When I know I can't go to the comic shop and there's some comic books that I really want and I know they're gonna sell out quick. Cause lately, what's really on fire lately is X-Men after the whole Hellfire Gala thing. I do have two covers of that one, which I'm gonna keep cause I know that's gonna be a, a hot item in the future. Here is the receipt. And here is the famous bag paper bag how are you all doing tell me down below if you like my comic videos if so which one was your favorite that i picked and i showed off today let's show them off oh this one's in reverse this is from the invisible iron man number eight this has to do with the hellfire gala and it is one of my favorite x-men slash villains this is Emma Frost. Then I have this cool. It looks more like a. It's more like a Howard the Duck homage. And we have here Magneto number one. Look at that. Look at Savior's face. Face palming. Then we have here. Let me. This is X Men 25. This is an Alex Ross cover. Look at that, look at this baby. We got Beast, Jean, Storm, Archangel, and Professor X. This is an homage to the Jim Lee X-Men number one cover. Then we have a Scotty Young cover of Astonishing Iceman number one. And our final cover is the comic, the, I got this, cause I love, I, I love Jake Scott's Campbell. And I got this, uh, 
Hellfire Gala 2023 number one from the Fall of X event. We have this cool X-Men cover but with the original five X-Men Beast, Angel, Iceman, Marvel Girl, and Cyclops. So that's what I got today. Tell me down below what was your favorite comic book? If you're not subscribed, take this moment and subscribe to my channel. Share the video. We are on a road to 1K. We get to the 1K, we're gonna do a lot of giveaways. And pretty soon on September 4th, it is Labor Day. So we're all gonna be technically free. I'm gonna have my birthday bash. If you wanna send anything my way, down below is my Amazon wish list. So if you haven't, please subscribe to my channel, like all my videos, hit the notification button, and tell your mom, your uncle, your sister, and even your grandma because my grandma follows me and stay safe be awesome ba -ba 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 -ba. booyah too sweet baby